what we're doing today. No. We're gonna do an experiment with milk. Okay, so she has some idea what we are gonna do today. So let's get started. So we so, have a plate. Yeah. We have some food colors. We have soap. Yeah. We have some milk. Yeah. And we have some cotton buds. No cotton buds. Not balls. <laughs> it's cotton buds. You know buds? Yeah. Ah, okay. You but said cotton buds. I said cotton buds. Buds. And um, cotton buds. No, I said cotton buds. <laughs> You're confusing me now. Okay. What color is this, Eva? Orange. What about this? Green. What about this? Yellow. And what about this? Red. And this one? Blue. Very good, girl. So first we are gonna pour milk to the plate. Yeah, I'm in it. Oh, yeah, okay, you wanna pour? <laughs> Catch it, Eva. Okay, okay. Okay. First we are gonna drip some blue color. Okay. Yes. We yeah. have one drop there. Yeah. Now we'll drip some orange color. Yeah, I will drip you. Just a little bit. Yes. Yeah. We have orange there. Yeah. Just now a green. little bit. Green, green, green. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, just a little bit. Green there. And what color we want? Red? Yeah. That's Three. enough, I guess, Eva. Three. Three Only four enough. colors. Okay? Okay, so Eva, yeah. I'm gonna dip the cotton buds yeah. in the soap. Yeah. <laughs> and then you put it, okay? Okay. Okay. Catch this. Do you know why this is happening? Yeah. Why? Because it's look like flower. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay guys, I'm gonna explain it to you why. Because there is a tension on the surface of the water or milk or any liquid, okay? So we are breaking it by pouring some soap. You can try with any soap, okay? Let it be dishwash soap or uh, hand wash soap. Have you guys seen some insect in your well? It it just walks on the water. Have you seen Eva? Any insect walking on the water? No. Yes, I will show you next time we go to it's India. It's in the fish. No, not fish. There are some insect that can walk on the surface of the water. Like you can see the insect on top of the water because the insect is very light and it's not at all heavy. So it can walk because there is a tension over the surface and they won't break it. So the soap can break the tension and it moves and it moves to different places. That's why it's called surface tension. Okay, so we are breaking the surface tension. Yeah. Okay guys, I'm going to show you another example for surface tension. This example will be very similar for you because you might have seen in so many other videos. It's with water and some pepper, okay? And some milk. No, there is no milk for this. Do you know what is this? Pepper. Yes. Now I'm going to put some little amount of pepper. It's pepper spicy. Yes, pepper is very spicy, yeah? yeah. Okay. So the pepper is just like the insect I told you before. It's yeah. very light, so yeah. it can float over the water. Yeah. Let's see. See? Yeah. 
see it's floating mm. so now Eva is gonna dip her finger in the soap and then she's gonna dip it in the pepper water Did you see the pepper moving to the sides? Yeah. And do you know why? Yeah. Why? I don't know. Okay. That's good. That's good catch, Eva. Do you guys understand what this is about? Okay. So grab some pepper, soap, food colors, and try these in your home with your parents, with your siblings, and whoever is there in your home. Yeah, Eva? Yeah. I tried this milk and pepper experiment in my school. And for, water! Yeah, in water. Uh, in my school and exhibition, pepper. not once, but twice. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so bye bye, guys. Bye. Well, she's very busy playing in the water. Bye, bye guys. guys. Okay, Eva, I'm going. I have some other work to do. Bye, guys. Okay. See you later. Don't forget to subscribe! Bye friends! Don't forget to subscribe! We're going to do a milk experiment. Yeah. What?